Indie movies are great because they take risks that those million dollar blockbusters just can't. And a subtitled movie about a vampire in Iran is a risk that certainly pays off for this guy in the best new movie on Netflix this week. I'm Clint Gage, and you're watching Stream On on Movie Phone. A girl walks home alone at night takes place in a depressing and deserted Iranian city. A vampire falls in love with a drug dealer because love is blind, and vampires usually don't worry about falling in love with people who have health insurance. They're down for whatever. <laughs> This movie is unique. It's like a bunch of genres mashed together, and it works. The visuals are great, the story is perfectly creepy, and it's full of suspense. As long as you can read, you should check out this movie. And if you can't read, learn how to read this weekend. And if you don't feel like learning how to read this weekend, don't even sweat that because there are millions of other things for you to watch, including Sons of Anarchy Season 7, which will be on Netflix Saturday. You need to know that every single one of you would die for the man next to him. We're all in, brother. The final season of this show is just as violent and glorious as the rest of the series. If you're a fan and haven't seen season 7 yet, get on it. There are big payoffs and not many disappointments. If you're new to the show, the other six seasons are already on Netflix. And finally, the 2007 British comedy Hot Fuzz is now on Netflix. A top cop from London gets promoted to a boring small town and, well, Hilarity ensues. Is it true that there is a place in a man's head that if you shoot it, it will blow up? This is a classic British comedy, which you know I love. It's super smart, and it's also super silly. Not everyone's a murdering psychopath. It's high time you realize that. You and your monkey. Did he mean me or that? This one is easy to watch with guaranteed laughs. Kind of like Stream On with Clint Gage. Get it? No? You sure? Come on. No, that's all right. That's all for this week anyway. I'll see you next week.